Good morning, Sadis. Today, Miss, we are doing some of uh, the reading comprehension exercises from the booklet. So I want you to start with page three. In page three, we have an exercise on the vocabulary. Fill in the space with the suitable words from the box. And we have some words like fashion, leather, lihi ma'naha jildi aw jild. Fi indi pattern, hakena pattern, yani when something has patterns like lines and shapes. Fi indi project, lihi ma'naha mashru, and silky, which is uh, which means that it is made of silk. Bi ma'na hariri. Let's start with number one. I chose a jacket and some designer sunglasses. And here I have a jacket, which is a noun. We want to describe it, Miss. I want to give you a description. I want to give you more information about it. When we look at the كلمات the words that I have, we will see that it is a leather jacket. In the usual way, when we see the jacket, we see that it is leather. It is made out of leather. Number two, some cats have smooth fur. Now we can say that the fur of the cats is silky, بمعنى إنه هو ناعم أو حريري. Number three, tomorrow we are putting on our show of modern clothes. Now because we have a show and it is about modern clothes, الملابس الحديثة, so it is a fashion show. Number four, the jug is with red spots. كان هاد الجاك أو الإبريق في عليه بقع حمراء أو دوائر حمراء وبالتالي it is patterned and number five our next will be about space now we have the word project our next project will be about space let's go to page four we have reading uh, questions or reading exercises read the text and answer the questions Number one, what have the children been learning about? We said that they have been learning about the clothes around the world. Number two, who like the sarong from Malaysia? We said that Anna liked the sarong from Malaysia. Number three, what did Fred think about the Scottish kilt? Now he said, or he thought that it was interesting. Number four, what were the children going to do in the afternoon? Now we said that they are going to do the rehearsal. Because the next day they have the fashion show. Number five, who brought the clothes? We said that Mr. Barry brought the clothes for them. What had happened to Miss Barry? Now we said that Miss Barry uh, had to look after her nieces and nephews because their mother or her sister is in the hospital. Number seven, what did the friend find? Now we said that he found a pirate costume and a space suit. But let's Rijal Fada. Okay, A to true or false. Anna found a friend costume in the bag. Now after reading the text, you will see that it wasn't Anna who found the frog costume, it was Fred. Number nine, who hasn't got anything in you at home? Now the one who hasn't got anything in you at home was Lucy. Now read and write the correct word. My sari is gorgeous. Gorgeous tasa at sadas bimana amazing or very beautiful. Now we want to find an adjective from that sentence and you will see that the word gorgeous is the adjective. Now in the other sentence we want to find a possessive noun bimana isam mulkiya. Barhnijilajumla the clothes brought from Barry's fashion last week. Uh, the clothes were brought from Paris fashion last week. راح يكون في عندي هون الأبوستروفي هي اللي راح تدلني على الملكية. So Paris with the apostrophe and the s is the possessive noun. And that was the end of our exercises. Thank you for watching and have a good day.